Hey guys, today I'm here to, re to review a pair of Bluetooth headphones sold by Bluetooth Labs. As you can see right here, there are the headphones right there. They are nice and small and lightweight. They are 40% smaller than most other headphones on the market. They are all, about half the weight as them as well. They are nice and small. They don't have like, since they're on-ear headphones, they don't have the ear cups compared to other headphones like the Beats by Dre Solo, Solo HDs out there. But these ones just go on your ear, so let's take a close up on the headphones. They do fold up like the Beats headphones, but yeah. So here's a close up. There's the speaker themselves, the headphone. It has a nice mesh soft finish right there, so it goes comfortably on your ear. Going along here, you will also find the buttons, which I'll get to later. So as you see here, this is a matte, like matte rubber finish, so it does gather a lot of dust since the color is black, so it does gather dust, as I said. So you continue here, here's the top of the band. There's no like a foam or anything right here, it's just the matte finish, so still does fit comfortably on your head. And on the other side, you also find the same thing, the speaker right there for your headphones. It does have the left and right indicators to tell you which side to put them on. Um, here are the bands themselves, they have like a metal finish in there, so it's nice and durable. This side is a bit tighter compared to this side, which is really loose for some reason. This side, uh, you can hear right here, it's nice and clicky, nice and tight. So, on the outside, you will notice that it has a glossy finish, and I got the headphones in a black color. So, they do gather a ton of fingerprints, as you can see right here. Well, these headphones do come in five other colors, like white, blue, green, and uh, red, which I think they won't uh, attract as much dust as they attract a lot of fingerprints like the black color. So as you can see right there, fingerprints all around. So when you're using them or putting them away, just give them a quick wipe and they'll look nice and new, nice and clean. So let's get to the controls on this side right here. So the middle button acts as the power button to turn it on. So once you turn it on, just press and hold and it will state that it says power on in the headphones there's no LED indicator as I noticed around the headphones so once you power that on and connect it to, from, connect it to your phone and you can just play music right away it is a Bluetooth 4.0 so it's really easy to connect once you're connected that button also acts as the play pause and answer and hang up button so the um, built-in microphone is right here under the right side that hole right there is the built-in microphone so above that one is the volume up and next track so to play the next track just press it once to change the volume up you just press and hold for a while and below it is also the same thing but it's the previous track and the volume down same thing for the top press and hold for, for uh, volume down and single press for our previous track and to charge these headphones there's the micro USB port right there to charge it so let's talk about the sound quality as the website states that these have really impressive bass I didn't find any bass on these headphones at all but there is some little bit of bass but not too well but the treble on these headphones like the vocals and other things are really nice and clear so no bass at all in my opinion as I see it and the treble is nice and clear so I like that once I have these on my head it doesn't even look like I have anything on my head at all because my hair color is black so it does blend in with my hair and yeah you can take a look pairing is just as I said earlier just hold and press this button until it says pairing then go in your phone connect these work with all devices that are Bluetooth capability so yeah, if you like these headphones, check them out.